Mangum has time off. 368 days. That's how long it's been since Tanner Mangum last started at quarterback for BYU. Well, it's crazy to think about, you know, that it's been that long. It goes by fast. That last start is one he won't soon forget. The Cougars gave up five turnovers on their first five possessions in a close loss to Utah in the Las Vegas Bowl. Since that game, he's played little, throwing the ball just 18 times in the last three games. I feel good. I feel stronger. I feel uh, more confident. Obviously, it, it does help getting game time, and I haven't had as much as that this season, but, you know, it's, it's all good. Just got to make the most of it. Mangum certainly made the most of it last year as a true freshman. After replacing Taysom Hill due to a season-ending injury, he led the Cougars to a win over Nebraska with his famous Hail Mary. He finished the season with nearly 3,400 yards passing and 28 touchdowns. This year, he replaces Hill once again, but after watching most of the season from the sidelines. Kind of like last year, you just have to roll with the punches and adjust week by week, and you know, here is a chance to play, so I just got to get ready to go and do the best I can to, to finish the season strong. What's the biggest lesson you learned from the sideline this year as you were able to watch? I just learned how important it is to stay up and, and support your teammates no matter what. Could have been easy to just, you know, sulk and be miserable, but I just kind of took it on myself to not let that get to me and to still stay positive, stay upbeat, and have fun with it and make the most of it. How much do you love Ty Detmer's offensive scheme? I love it a lot. We have to read the front and decide if we're going to run left, run right, if we're going to check from a pass to a run or a run to a pass. And so there's a lot that goes into it. So you have to be, you know, on your toes. To be on his toes against Wyoming, Mangum will use every bit of practice time he can and get important reps he didn't get throughout the season. And he can't wait to finally play a game with Jamal Williams. Well, it's great having Jamal back. And uh, I've yet to play with him, really, uh, even though we got here at the same time, 2012. Um, this, this will be my first game with him, so I'm excited to have him there, and he's, he's been awesome all year. And finds the end zone, touchdown! We just want to get this win, and, and we've uh, you know, had a lot of ups and downs this year, so now to be able to finish with nine wins again and against a really tough schedule um, would be huge. Kathy Aiken, BYU TV Sports.